gentlemen, welcome back to the Fishing with Yak Pack YouTube channel. Today, we're gonna be testing the brand new Wild Bite fishing kits from Walmart. We've got a large, this is the bass, right? Yeah, we've got a largemouth Wild Bite fishing kit and we've got a panfish Wild Bite fishing kit. Today, we're starting off the video here at the creek. We're gonna see what kind of panfish we can catch with this bad boy. Let's go ahead and bust these things open and see what exactly comes inside. Before we do that though, make sure you guys hit this video with a thumbs up, make sure you subscribe. Now, let's bust them open. All right, so we've got the panfish and we've got the bass wild bite fishing kit. I'm gonna go ahead and bust open the panfish kit because like I said, we're starting here at the creek today and let's just see, I'm getting tore up by ants. All right, so apparently this thing comes with four, eight, 12, 12 different size hooks, swivels, split shots, two bobbers, and a spade with hook removers that you can connect together because it says we're gonna have to dig for worms. And that's gonna be fun because I don't know where to find worms. Also, the kit comes with an educational guide on how and where to catch fish. That's a pretty cool little case though, not gonna lie. I mean, that's kind of like a, you're going to like work, take this with you, try to hit the pond afterwards, maybe a little creek, get a little creek stepper action, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Oh my gosh, here's our shovel tray. This is, this is our shovel. If this doesn't break today, that's a dub. Wild bite educational guide. All right, let's see what this thing says. Oh my gosh. Oh, it gives us instructions. I wish it came with uh, some of Fishing with Norm's secret fishing spots. That would be a little bit better. Pretty cool little educational guide here. It tells you where to catch panfish, where to catch bass, where to catch trout. Definitely gonna be no trout in this video because we are in Florida and I don't think that we have trout here. First and foremost, fishing code, safety first. Hooks are sharp. Now you know, hooks are sharp. Don't play with hooks, kids. Keep it clean. Save the turtles. Clean your trash up. Don't be a litter bug, because nobody likes a litter bug. I get right into the panfish. 25 piece tackle kit? There's, you're telling me there's 25 pieces of tackle in this. Somebody's capping here. Two bobbers and a bunch of just tackle. Yeah, it's definitely 25 pieces. Okay. Now that we've got the wild bite panfish kit unboxed, it's time to do some worm digging. If I was a worm, where would I live? Probably live right there. It's worth a shot. Okay, Trey, that's not worms. Spot number one was a failure. Okay, so it's very clear there were no worms in an ant bed. Let's get a little bit closer to the creek, Trey. I feel like the ground would be a little softer the closer to the creek that we get. So maybe, just maybe, there could be some worms there. You gotta watch for snakes. It's snake season, boys. All right, right here's good. Oh my gosh. I don't think this is gonna dig too good. I don't think this is gonna work. Trey, I just remembered something from the Worm Digging Championship back in 74. You can make a pine cone a, a worm collar. All right, let me show you how to do this, Trey. So you take about four or five of those from the bottom, you rip them off. All right, you ready? Rub it in the dirt a little bit. Ready? Rub it in the dirt. Calling all worms! It didn't work. It's clear that our, uh, our worm digging kit right here is not working because the dirt is still really hard. But that's okay, because I've got a backup plan. Plan B. Something tells me if I was a worm, I would live somewhere in this vicinity. And this looks like a great spot to dig. Oh my gosh, what is that? What, what is that? Oh, we found them, Trey. We found the worms. Oh my gosh, it's, we definitely didn't put these here because we suck at finding worms and left for a 40 minute drive to Walmart to buy worms to put in the ground because we couldn't find any worms, but we found worms. All right boys, now that we've got the Wild Bite Panfish Kit unboxed and we have located our worms, we definitely didn't put these here. We're gonna go ahead and get rigged up. We're gonna hit the creek right here and see what we can catch. First person to three panfish wins, and then once that happens, that will allow us to move on to the next spot where we can catch potentially some really big largemouth bass. Almighty. Oh. 
What did I say? So, you ready? I'm catching three first cast. First cast? First cast. Oh, three on one, a three on one? Yep. The whole three on one special. All right, let's go. Dude, I can't believe we filmed these worms, man. We definitely didn't put these here. That was That's so, so crazy. clutch. So clutch. Because this definitely did not work. It's like I thought it was going to work. All right, let's see. So we've got, which barber do you want? Oh, uh, that one. Little one? Yeah. Okay. All right, let's see. Bluegill, panfish, rock bass. Dump that out. What size hook are we gonna need? Oh, the smallest the one. The smallest one? All right. That's the one I want right there. All right, I think I'll do the same. And I think I'm actually gonna probably, should we put, I don't know if we should use these little weights that it comes with, I'm not sure. I think I'm gonna use one. Are you? Give me the snip. You're gonna use a split shot? Yeah. Where do you put a split shot? Oh, <laughs> good thing we've got a god. <laughs> put a split shot. Okay, so it's bobber, split, split shot, hook, hook. That makes oh, sense. Yeah, it does. I'm the freaking best at bluegill fishing, as you can see. Yeah. 1947 bluegill world champion over here. World champ, baby. Yeah. Not to brag or anything. But no, dude. No, but not a big flex. I think we are rigged and we are ready, boys. I'm ready. Let's, let's get it. All right, boys. Let's do the smart thing and work our way down to this bridge right here. We're we gonna be walking through water. Oh no, it's mushy. Don't want to ruin my shoes. Oh, it's getting very mushy. Oh no, it's very mushy. Oh. Mush, mud, and snakes. That's what you gotta like. All right, let's see. We're working our way down, boys. We're on a trek today. So we just gotta watch out for spiders, alligators, snakes, and everything else that could potentially harm you in Florida, which is everything. Oh gosh, dude, this is sketchy. This is sketch level 1.5. We've got current, we've got shade, and we've got a worm with the Walmart wild bite fishing kit. Let's see if we can get something going in here. I'll tell you what, there's a lot of bugs under here. Oh, oh, what a bite, big bite, big bite. Come for it again, I bet you won't, I bet you won't. Oh, he did, oh, oh my gosh, dude. I don't know what I'm getting tore up by, but I'm getting tore up. One more time, baby, one more time, one more time. He's got it, he's got it, I got him, I got him, let's go, let's go. Oh, first fish of the day on the Wild Bite Walmart fishing kit. Oh, boy, you can't tell me nothing. Why I catch a fish out of a mud puddle, do y'all see that right there? Do y'all see this right here? That's a freaking pet store bluegill right there, baby. Let's freaking go. Y'all can't tell me nothing. Look at that hook set too. Boy, y'all better get out my face. Y'all better get out my face. Come here, buddy, I got you. And I still got some worm left. I told y'all, 74 state champion worm hunter. Look at this. Look at this thing right here. Mm, mm, mm. Can't tell me nothing, baby. Can't tell me nothing. Smoked him. Smoked him on the Guggen rod. No. Yo. I just broke my rig off. I just broke my rig off. You said you broke off? Yeah. That's tough. Trey's right above me on the bridge right up there and I guess he broke off. That's unacceptable guys. Though we did catch fish on the, the wild bite fishing kit. Let's see if we can catch something a little bit bigger. We might have to get in the trenches for this one though. We might have to take the shoes off and walk in the creek. Which is always scary because we're in Florida and alligators like to live in Florida. In the water. In places like this. All right, here we go. Get rigged back up with the worms we found underground and not in the Walmart fishing section. Oh God, worms, worm juice. Worm juice on my hands. Makes me feel like a man. Oh, we slipping and we sliding, boys. Is that a slippery rock? It is. I'm trying to get just close enough to wash my hands off in the water. Okay, first fish down for me. First one of three wins. And then we move on to the bass spot. Oh my gosh, what is that? Holy smokes. 
There we go. I don't even know what this is. Oh, we're definitely increasing in size. I think I found them. I think I found them. We're on fire now. Yeah, baby. Look at that hook set once again. Still got my worm left. Look at this. That right there, ladies and gents, is a dinner plate. Absolute stud. Second fish down for me. Like I said, first one of three wins. Then we can move on to uh, the bass spot. Look at that. One last look. Beautiful fish on the Walmart Wild Bike Kit. There he goes. Oh my gosh. Hello, Trey. You I caught two so far. Really? Yeah, have you? No, I caught nothing. Oh, dang. Sounds like I'm gonna get to three before you. It's all right, I'll just take care of the biggest bass. Oh, I see, I see. Take your wins while you can get them. Okay, yeah. Well, that's going to be all day for me. All right, we'll see, I guess. All right. He thinks he's going to outfish me? He has no idea. Because I'm about to catch my third one right here. Just like that. Oh, just kidding. Just prank. Oh, he took my worm. Got him. Oh. Whew, these fish are so fast. I don't know. Call me crazy. Bluegill fishing or panfish fishing is 10 times harder than bass fishing. Ooh, there's a nice little hump out here. Some grass. Look at this. Oop. I broke off my bobber. Oh, God, I'm already getting bites. I'm already getting bites. First of three. Oh, I'm going to catch them right here. Right on this grass line. Got retied after breaking off my bobber. Haven't caught any yet, unfortunately, but... Looks like there's a lot of fish here. Oh my goodness, I just got slammed. I don't know how TJ's doing. I've heard him screaming over there. <gasps> I caught one! I hear Trey over here hollering. That's not good. Oh no! Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Let's go. I don't know what this thing is. First fish of the day, no, come here. I don't have a clue what this is, but fish number one for me, I mean, I guess that's a pan, oh. Okay, there you are. Fish number one for me is a little creek minnow. Pan fish number one, first of three wins. Let's get him back. Yes. cast <laughs> no wonder how tj is doing oh we got oh, let's, go. <laughs> let's go baby let's go fish number three for me oh this is actually uh this is a this isn't a pan fish i don't think this is a this is a warm mouth or a rock bass let me see wow yeah look at that that's not a bluegill See how big his mouth is? Yeah, look at this fish right This is not a bluegill. That's either a warm mouth or a rock bass. Let me know down in the comments. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, I feel like a warm mouth has more red on them or something. So this has definitely got to be a rock bass, which is so sick, actually, now that I think about it, because I don't think I've ever caught a rock bass. Dude, please, somebody in the comments confirm or deny. Please tell me this is a rock bass, because I've never caught one of these. Let's freaking go. Fish number three for me. Now I need to go check in with Trey real quick, see what he's got and then off to the big bass spot. Let's go check on Trey real quick and see what he's got going on. All right, Trey, where you at? Here you are. Three fish for me. That's it? Yep. Uh, what do you mean that's it? Hang on. What'd you catch? I caught 10. 10? No, I caught one. You caught one? Ah, let's I did go. Have a double up on though. You had a double? I had a double. <laughs> oh my gosh, are I they just sitting here chilling? Yeah. Oh, look at all of them down there. Dude, I didn't call like two or three different species. Oh, okay. All right. Well, you really won. Yeah. No way. Come on, baby. You know you're talking to. 84, 85, back to back, bluegill bussing champ. You know the deal. Hey, we've completed this part of the challenge so far. Now, let's move on to where the big bass live 
and go test out the Walmart wild bite kit for a bigger fish. Hey boys, real quick, while we're making our way to the next spot, make sure you guys check out GuggenSquad.com, the brand new drop that they just did, all the new spring collection gear. I'm gonna show you guys really quick what my little favorite outfit is that they just dropped. If you wanna scoop some from GuggenSquad.com, you can use code YAKPAC, linked in the description below. Check it out though. We've got the brand new boat shorts. These things are four-way stretch and they fit the big thighs. These things fit incredibly. Moisture wicking, dry super fast. They've got a liner in them. There's uh, two other pair of shorts, but you've got this pair of shorts right here. And then you've got the little golf polo. If you're trying to get fancy, you know what I'm saying? Get a little fancy. Anyways, GoogleSquad.com, code Jackpack. Love you guys. Let's go catch some bass. Good for bon a Yeah. Get the Lamborghini's a break. Oh, Lamborghini's. Getting a little dirty today, boys. That's all right. Because we're here now. The pond's that way. Yeah. Looks good. He, just, he did also just say that he was catching big ones. So yeah, that's that's a, that's a plus. It's always a plus. We'll see what we can do. Put the spinning rods to work. Dude, I'm dude, it took us a lot longer to catch those three bluegill or the it took us a lot longer to catch those three panfish than I thought it was going to. It took you a lot longer yeah. to catch those three panfish. Yeah. That's all right, uh, yeah. That's, that's all right, because I'm in my oven now. You're, yeah, I know, right? Yeah, I'm in the zone. I'm ready. I'm freaking. You better catch it quick, because I'm gonna catch it. I'm zoned, man, boys. We're going for a big one. We are going for a big one. What's the goal? Four pounder? Twelve. Nothing less than twelve. Anything less than twelve, 12. shake it. Take I'll it all on it. We only want. Oh, dude, I got all the people and I got all the connections you need to make that happen. Yeah. Oh, I'm on. I'm on. I'm on. I'm off. I'm off. Oh, I'm still on. Oh my gosh. I'm on. I was off. I was on and I was off. And now I'm on again. Come here, baby. I was on and I was off and now I'm on again. That boy's on fire. That boy's on fire. Okay. There we go. Yeah, let's look at that, Trey. Look at Trey. Trey, you see this? No. You all see it? Well, there it is. If you didn't see it, now you see it. Dude, let's go. That's exactly what we're after, boys. Perfect. Oh, dude, I'm ruining the shoes today, that's for sure. Well, boys, quick little update. The, uh, turns out the, wall, uh, the Walmart Wild Bite Fishing Kit does not come with fishing lures, and we ran out of uh, actual worms, so we've resorted to the old nose fail here. We've got the blazing worm. We're just gonna be ripping this thing until we uh, can catch three, and we'll see how it goes. Oh no, dude, I just missed one. I'll catch it for you, don't you worry about that. Somebody's got to, I'm sucking today. No! I've got three bites on three casts and missed them every time. Striking out. Right. What did I oh, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> dude, how did I get a wind knot? Look at that. Look at that. Oh my gosh! Oh, he just, look at that, I got a wind knot and I just got destroyed. That's what you get, dude. I'm over here talking smack the tray. I got straight braid now. I'm not breaking off. Oh my gosh. I got a bad wind knot I'm having to deal with. No. No, dude. No. Oh, that's me. No, this is bad. I'm about to catch one right beside No, don't do it because. to me, Trey. Don't do it to me. Oh, he's on. Oh, he's on. Let's go. Uh oh. Oh. Look at my knot. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> no, I lost him. Look at this knot, Trey. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, dude, I'm gonna have to cut it and retie. That's tough. Y'all might see me tie the fastest knot y'all have ever seen me tie before in my life. What is going on with this thing? Oh, Trey, what did I do? You what did I do? It. I boofed bad. This is not good. This, you would act like I knew what I was doing when I was fishing? Definitely not. Oh, no! He was, he was shaking. God, dude, it got me stuttered. I, he was shaking his head and everything. All right, boys, back in business. Back in business. You ready? Are you ready? Let's go! Just like that, we're back in the game. Let's go. He's got to follow him. Oh, is it one to one? That's official one to one. That's official one to one. All right now. All right now. Just like that, it is one to one, but I gotta get him back so I can catch another one. Peace. That's a good one. That's oh, a good one. No, dude. That's a good one. That's, That's a good one. Number two. Dang it. 
Ah, number two, and it's a good one, baby. Number two, and it's a good one. Get out my face, Trey. It's because you're ahead of me. Is it? Yeah. They don't call me the Walmart wild bite fishing champ for nothing. Oh, just oh. like that, it's two to two. two. It's two, two to two. two. It's two to two. Just like that. Oh my gosh. All right, I'm getting back in before I freaking. I cannot lose this. I cannot lose. I cannot lose. Can't do it. I can't lose either. See ya. You got to You got better get another worm. We just crossed lines. Jeez. I'm still fishing, mom. Oh. I No, 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 no! Stop! No, no! Let's go! Oh no, I'm hung. Oh no! Is there a brush pile out here? Yeah. He found it. <laughs> oh, yeah, he I said, yeah, there's one in here. Oh, come on. Oh, dude, no. I, just, I set the hook on something that was not a fish. Now I'm in all the bushes. Dang it, dude. How do I find the one brush pile in the whole pond? Are you good, Trey? Almost. Almost. All right, I'm good. All right. No, dude, no. Lose it, lose it, lose it. Lose it! Lose it! Lose it. Get it off my lose face, it. that's a good lose one. Lose Get out my lose face, it. that's a good one. Get out my face. Good oh. God almighty. Oh. <laughs> What did I say? What? No! Oh, my God. oh, Trey! Oh, my gosh, Trey! No way. Oh, dude. Choke the blazing worm. Trey, dude, I don't know if I've ever had somebody mess with me that hard when I've had such a good fish on. Oh, my God. Oh, my, God. Oh, my gosh, dude. Oh, oh, God. Come here. God, he's got some freaking chompers on him. Oh, dude. Look at that. Oh, dude, that bad boy, it's three pounds on the dot, or it's three pounds. No, no shot, it's not three pounds. Look how freaking thick this thing is. It's a thick boy. <laughs> Victory dance, victory dance. Oh, he's hooked up, he's hooked up. Oh, he's hooked up too. Doubles. Doubles, let's go. What a fish. Fish bump. I think that one's good. <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't want to keep him out of water too long, Trey, but. There we go, baby. That's a nice a right minimum there. three pounds. That's definitely three pounds. Minimum three pounds, baby. Let's freaking go. A three pounder to end the three fish challenge? How about that? Whoa! Okay. I can't believe you beat me. I can't believe you tried to sabotage me as hard as you did and I still caught that fish. Yes, dude, dude he was bit it out there and ran all the way over here. <laughs> he did, didn't he? Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, boys. Well, technically, he was what? I was <laughs> pushing the rod and everything. Technically, I did in fact win the challenge, but we still have daylight, so why not fish for a little bit longer? Just see what we can do, you know. Oh, oh God! Good thing you're still recording, Trey. It's a freaking big one. It's a unit. Oh. Oh, oh my gosh. Fast thumb. Look at Let's that. Go. Oh my gosh. Oh no speeding cricket. Oh Let's yeah. Go. We ran out of worms very fast pretty much. And uh the wild bite fishing kit just wasn't doing so hot for the didn't bass. Come very much tackle. Yeah. Didn't come with uh any tackle whatsoever, but heck yeah, dude. Nice catch. Thanks for biting. Sick bite. My biggest fish of the day. We'll catch you next time.